Holy shit, YouTube, man. I just lit fire to this dude right here, man. Crazy. Columbia Economics degree. Talking about going to thug it out in the damn army. Listen, man. Here's the deal, folks. You know how I feel about enlisting with a college degree. Man, don't try to tell me you're trying to make yourself better when you're talking about going to thug it out in the army as an E1. Absolutely ridiculous video. We talking about nuclear mentorship here. This ain't, this ain't even fire mentorship. We just made this dude disappear. Okay, now listen, here's the deal in leadership. When you kill a motherfucker and you snatch their heart out of their body, you gotta follow up, man. I gave this call, I gave this young dude, Cold Train, a call after we got done lighting fire to him, and I'm gonna talk to him again today on Saturday, man. So listen, man, I, I know it's hard, I know it's hard to listen to, but I'm telling you, we gotta get through to these young people and make them understand that enlisting with a college degree is not the way to go. I hope you enjoy the video, which I think you will, but I'd love for you to share this bad boy because we're going to get some traction on this fire-ass mentorship video. And as always, you know what we're building around here. That's right. We build champions for life. Enjoy the video. Absolutely. You know the recruiter's lying to you. Yeah. Okay? That's a fucking flat-out lie, bro. Dude, my dude just graduated from Airborne. Seer, uh, what other school did he go to? Well, I'm specifically talking about sniper school. Okay, I got fucking 15 officers been to fucking sniper school. Specifically, Coltrane. With a fucking Columbia degree? Bro, how much money? Are your parents fucking rich? No. Then what the fuck are you doing, dude? Why don't you just go get a construction job for the rest of your life? Why'd you go to Columbia University? I had an opportunity to do it. I wanted to be the best. Okay, then why the fuck are you going to take 50 steps back and be a fucking enlisted dude? Sniper school, bro. Like, I got all sorts of officers went to fucking sniper school. I have, a more have you ever Have you ever shot a fucking long gun? Yeah. Like, what have you shot? I actually got the opportunity to shoot the 50 cal sniper. Okay, that don't fucking count. Have you shot a, a 308 sniper rifle? No. Okay, have you shot a fucking 300 win mag? No, the only one I shot. So, so you got no fucking idea what you're talking about wanting to be a fucking sniper. Would you agree with that? Yeah. Okay, you're not going to try to call, bring the fucking, some call to duty in here or some shit like that, are you? No. Okay, so listen, coaching. I can't fucking tell you any more fucking vehemently like, you're making the worst life decision that you've ever fucking made in your life going enlisted because you want to go to fucking sniper school. Like, I can't, I, I can't tell you any other way. Like, like, literally, there's fucking stupid, there's dumb, and there's full-blown IQ of one. Your ass is like negative 50 fucking million with a Columbia degree talking about I want to enlist so I can go to fucking sniper school. If you want to go to sniper school so bad, save your fucking $4,000 and just pay for it as an officer. You can do that? Absolutely you can do that. Okay? But, like, don't come on here and fucking, like, dog, it's just fucking stupid, bro. And then for you to use the words, I'm going to thug it out, like, bro, get the fuck out of here, man. You want to be average? You want to go back to being fuck average? Then go ahead. Now you graduate with a fucking Ivy League degree. You talk about you want to go thug it out? Bro, think about what you fucking saying in the context of the words that you just fucking used. Think about that. Okay? You got an Ivy League education, and you just said, I'm going to go enlist in the Army and thug it the fuck out. Okay, did you have? Did you ever watch? You probably never even seen this. You remember Trump had that show called Apprentice, The Apprentice. I heard of it. Yeah. Okay, Google the, the the kid that said I'm white trash. I want you to go pull this up and watch the video of the motherfucker that told Trump he was white trash, sitting in the boardroom with a billionaire, and he said I'm white trash. Okay, like fatal, bruh. Like you gotta train, you gotta change, you gotta change the way you thinking about life, man. Like this is fucking crazy we having this conversation. Does that does that resonate at all with you? 
Yeah, I see. I, I, I think I get the, the, I think I get what you're saying. Um, I guess you, I guess you're kind of seeing it as like, I'm wasting opportunities and I'm throwing away something that, or I'm not, I'm not continuing on the path that I should have, that I started. You can't tell me that you want to be great. If you got a fucking Columbia degree from an Ivy league institution and you're going to fucking enlist in the fucking army. That is, that is too, that's a fucking complete oxy fucking moron. Okay? Like, that's what you're saying right now. I want to be the best. I want to be elite. But I'm going to go enlist and thug it out in the fucking army. But I got a Columbia degree. Mm, I'm fucking special. It's a fucking oxymoron, man. Oxy fucking moron. Okay? You need you need to fucking step back and look at what the fuck you trying to do cuz right now like this is fucking ludicrous man. That, that 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 that's like dude, I got a kid from Harvard. Okay? Harvard plays defensive end for Harvard. I just talked to him the other day. I just got the video back from my video dude. I said, "Hey, buddy, you thinking about going enlisted?" He was like, "Hell, no, I ain't going enlisted. I I'm graduating from fucking Harvard. I'm gonna be an officer." I said, "Good. Like I like to hear that. Appreciate it." Where to use your brain, okay? Like if you if you graduated from, mm, let's say you graduated from Bemidji State out there in South Dakota, where the fuck Bemidji State is, or you went to, uh, let's say you went to Houston Baptist, and you told me I'm gonna enlist in the army, I probably wouldn't be coming at your neck like I'm coming right now, okay? Or if you went to Pace, you know where Pace is? Pace University up there in, in Poughkeepsie or Pomixi or whatever it is. Okay. But you're graduating from one of the fucking top institutions in the fucking country, bro. Like I can't even, I don't even know what the fuck is saying. That's like say I went to Stanford. Hey man, what'd you do with your life? Oh man, I got a Stanford degree, but now, fuck. I work the back of the trash truck, man. I get in shape. I'm thugging out life right now. I'm just slinging trash cans on the back of the trash truck. Now, you in LA, you making 95, 100,000 a year slinging trash cans, but you got a fucking Stanford degree and you meeting about 1% of your fucking potential. Okay? Yeah, I guess I'm just like, I, I really don't want a management job. Okay, Coltrane, Coltrane. Coltrane. Hey, man, listen, I, I can't help you no more, bro. I'm, I'm going to tell you just fucking don't come on my calls no more. Because you're not in a management fucking job. You in charge of motherfuckers killing people. It ain't sitting at a fucking desk, bro. But if you don't want to realize that, then fuck. Go fuck off, man. Take your Columbia degree and your fucking brain power and go fuck yourself, man. Okay? Because it ain't it, like you don't even understand what you fucking getting into. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. And you just, you just keep fucking throwing more shit, more gas on this fucking fire, dude. Like, I just got on this fucking car and I'm blowing your fucking head off, man. Like, you think you think all this passion coming out of me because you're making the best decision in your fucking life? Okay? Like, but I can't help you. If you're going to be fucking stupid, hey, man, do this. Don't call me back when you enlist and you crying every day in the barracks. Because fucking some E-4 e fucking four got you cleaning a fucking toilet with a toothbrush and you trying to tell him you got a Columbia fucking degree and you want to go to sniper school. And you don't even get to go to sniper school for fucking... You may never get to go to sniper school. Because motherfuckers going to look at you and be like, yo, you the dumbest motherfucker in the world. You got a Columbia degree and you fucking an E-3? You fucking idiot. And then they're going to treat you like that. Because you just... You another fucking slave on a train, bro. That's all you are. But you could be the master, but you don't want to be the master. You want to go out in the field, thug it out. I can't give it to you no better than that, bro. I can't. Okay? Well, you. So you, you need to have some soul searching and fucking, you can stop coming on my fucking calls, bro. I'm going to tell you like this. I don't mentor motherfuckers like you because you guys always fucking fail because you, you try to reinvent the fucking wheel that's been around for a long fucking time and works really fucking good. There's a reason there's four fucking tires on a car. Because they circles and they roll really fucking good. Okay? Some of the best, most powerful people in the world come out of your fucking college. Why are you going to look going up to an alum from fucking Columbia 20 years from now? He said, hey man, what'd you do with your life? 
Oh man, I enlisted in the army. What? Dog, I got I got seven classmates that are fucking generals. Why'd you enlist? Oh man, I wanna thug it out. My dude, I wanna thug it out. Okay? Don't fucking come back on my calls no more until you figure out the fuck you're doing. Or call me on the telephone. Cause I'm fucking killing you for the last fucking 20 minutes because you fucking are on the dumbest shit in the world. Did you smoke fucking crack cocaine before you got on this fucking call? No. Did you smoke fucking heroin? Are you fucking high on heroin? We got to hit you with some Narcan? No. Okay, so you better figure it the fuck out, bro. But like, I'm just telling you, man, fucking stupid. Okay, I'm done with you. You're going to leave, you're going to stay on here. No, fuck that. Get the fuck off my call, man. You call me on the telephone tomorrow if you want to fucking talk to me. I can't have this dumb shit on my fucking call, man. Okay. I appreciate it, Coltrane. I'm sorry I got to blow your fucking head off, man. That's the dumbest shit I ever fucking heard in my life, bro. No, I probably needed it, yeah. Yeah, get the fuck off my call, man. All right. Man, holy shit, I need a break. I'm going to get a glass of water, motherfuckers, man. I appreciate y'all coming. I was late as fuck. Holy shit. Howdy, man. Thank you for the candor, brother. Thank you for the honesty. I couldn't agree more to this. I got washed because I was unprepared for the water evolutions. I killed the land stuff, but I couldn't even tie a knot underwater. Shit couldn't even tread water nor swim a sub-85. Shit was sad. I'll come back next time, though. Man, howdy, make sure you reach out and get the PDF so you're prepared, brother. I just wanted to say, hey, man, thank you for this awesome honest answer and yeah man showing up prepared equals failing brother showing up unprepared equals failing we build champions for life